Thank you. Uh, I realize there are two wagers that were put out here today. Number one, how long? Uh, under five minutes or over five. I promised Terry Gibbons and Coach Combs we'd be okay. The second one was whether or not I'd make it through it. Um, people know me as being pretty emotional, uh, except for the officials that have ever done any of our games, but I'm going to try to do this and, and be extremely fair to everyone. I already apologize to some people. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to use names after I mentioned the first name uh, with George Chris, but he's the gentleman who really was behind convincing me that this was... Yeah. Convincing me that this was something in my career, in my lifetime, and, and something that I needed to do and thought it would be a good fit. Because as Patty Christ and Heimer and the rest of the crew of the Chris would always remind me, if George says the Bears and Bo one more time in 1984, well, I think we've had some fun. First things first, for the administration here, the coaches, the players, the students, and everybody involved at the university, to take this time period to do this, thank you. It's, uh, it's quite an honor, uh, and I know it wasn't something that uh, you took lightly because by combining the fundraising efforts with it, it's been a very, very good cause and it's going to help a lot of other people. That's, that is really exciting. When Kelly and I in 1984 were deciding where we were going with our lives, people think, oh, well, it's just another coach, a professional that's going down to coach another team. But I have to tell you, we came to the city of Platteville, the University, Southwest Wisconsin, with a lot of things in mind other than just to develop a professional career for a coach. We came here to raise a family. And we came here to raise a family. And it was time. They were young. Megan stepped forward, Will and Matt. We, we came with three. We liked it so much, we had two more. And Brennan and Mary. Uh, that's, how, that's how much we fell in love with the place. And look what's already happened. That's begat more. And, and there was more, the, more to come. But the whole idea of coming to Platteville was to raise a family and to contribute to a community. From the things that Kelly got involved in and some of the things that we were involved in with the pioneers, it, we were not just Platteville. We were Southwest Wisconsin, our students, our, our university, what we did here. The people in this area were so supportive that we felt like we represented, represented a heck of a lot more than just the university. And the university is something we are extremely proud of, obviously. But it just seems that this is a family down here that has continued to grow, and we are happy to come back and be a part of this. I'd like for the guys who played when we were here, would you just kind of wave and just from where you are, other than the guys that were here, just wave and just... Uh, Kelly. Kelly said, make sure you acknowledge those people that were responsible for the 76 losses. I didn't think that was nice, Kelly. Well, I, and I also want to thank our current team and the, the Badger the staff people that came here today. Uh, They're, they're very supportive. I, I, I can't tell you enough about them, but this is about Platteville today and always will be here. And there is something that I want to finish this with, and again, trying not to name individuals because there's so many people that are responsible for the success this school had long before we came here and while we were here and long now after we are here. But when you have people like Dick Wadowitz, who was the coach here, Before, before we came here, there was, coach, what do you need? I got some films, I got some notes, what do you want? 
What a, what a tremendous welcoming committee to have the former coach here sit down and want to talk to some guy that was wet behind the ears and wasn't quite sure which way to turn. Dick, I thank you tremendously for that. And, but that's the way Platteville is. All the way through, everything is about helping other people. There's a lot of W's and L's that were repeated here, and, and columns and numbers on one side, one on the other, and we're extremely proud of that. But you know what? 15 years is a small timeline on the University of Wisconsin Platteville lifespan. The people before, during, and after, as I mentioned before, the one thing, the wins and the record is a whisper. What's going to speak the loudest is how you conduct your personal lives, what you give back to your communities, and what you want to be a part of in the long run. And to me, the University of Wisconsin Platteville people are the best. Thank you very much.